Give me a seven. Give me an M. Give me another M. Give me a C. What's that spell? Seven. How the heck did we get boarded by a submarine anyway? We're an airship for Petey Piranha's sake. En route to Yoster Isle, the ship of Mycias had run afoul of the dreaded Blargo, the subaquatic scourge of the basin. I propose a trade. You will help us convert our submarine into an airship, and we'll help you convert your airship into a submarine. But our ship is made of wood! It's not suited for... Oh, wait. I get it now. You get on quick, fun guy. How about you get acquainted with my boys while I get my balloons tied? <laughs> no harm in trying to make some friends, I suppose. The gang struck up a conversation with their guards, hoping to turn the situation around. The notorious pirate Chichiri throws the bones and predicts trolls in your future. Not right now, though. Fishbone Flightline is more of a straightforward platformer, as long as the fickle fishbones take you where you want to go. A cave-in has Link trapped in a cavern filled with the ferocious spike mites. While they might make this cave your grave, they might also be your ticket to escape in Nexar's Spike Might Strike. Zack Divine invites you to the domain of the Cloud Army. King and Queen Cloud have outstayed their welcome. Take them down a peg, and their people will thank you. Or not. Maybe you should check first. Silent Moon tells the old legend of the haunted swamp. It is said that the swamp will test anyone who dares enter it. Apparently there are paths that will appear one moment and disappear the next. Spooky stuff. Creaking corridors and cobwebbed corners hide a wealth of wigglers and a plethora of pokies in Rybones' Wiggle Worm Wanderlust. Can you find all the hidden nooks and crannies? One has to wonder which qualifications a ghost house architect needs. All aboard the Lacerating Locomotive! Some people say that trains made from spike balls are a terrible idea, but those people are cowards. Just put on some proper shoes and get spinning in Sacha's Tricky Train Track. Rubens Cube shares the myth of the Rosetta Block Trials. The stories indicate the block is covered in mysterious engravings. Perhaps you can decipher its meaning by witnessing clues around the lost island. Who lives in a pineapple under the sea? A goofy goomber called Bearware Bear Pants and his friends Wilfred and Box. It's a troll level where, oh, uh, and Daft Life and Soup Bowl, where, oh, uh, and Bedcliffe too. The best part is, that, well, well, Foggles and Major and Marble are part of this too, I guess. Anyway, the best part is where the Goomba says, it's Goombin' time, and Goom's all over those guys. steve -o! Just as Captain Syrup was about to drop the ship of Mycias in the drink, she spotted a familiar face on a stack of pamphlets. You mean to tell me this mook accidentally showered his gold over this island, and now these woodpeckers worship at his feet? I got a better pair of gams to worship, and wouldn't mind that kind of shower myself. How about we make a new deal? I'll let you pass me in the night and think nothing of it, and in exchange you give me the coordinates to my new cult. The toads were eager to strike a deal, though their merful mates were less enthusiastic. Pleasure doing business with you. Why don't you come down and see me sometime? The merfles would later learn that their people had no reason to fear further subjugation. And so, our airship remained an airship as it continued its course towards Yoster Isle, a few crew members and barrels of root grog richer. Patty House clings to the top spot in our speedrun league, but Charles and Ray Mega aren't far behind. To see all the current scores and to find out how to compete, head over to our Twitter. To find all the level codes collected in one place, visit mmcelebration.com. We will keep posting codes in the video descriptions as well, so subscribe to be notified. That's down Periscope for now. We'll resurface in a week. Glub, glub!